Greetings and welcome to my training on Smart Notebook. How do I create an attendance balloon pop without Flash? Well, now that Flash is gone, um, we have to set up our own method of creating the balloon pop. So I searched for balloons and just picked out some balloons and I copied the image. And then I went back to Smart Notebook and I pasted them in. After I pasted them in, I sized them. I chose different colors. Once I had all the colors I wanted, then I just selected the whole row and then copied and pasted until I had 35 balloons. You can adjust as needed um, so you can fit all your students in there. Once I did that, then I clicked on the text and I hit the screen. I just typed in a name like Sally. After I hit the name, then I sized it to fit into the balloon and place it into the balloon itself. I can also change the color of the font just in case uh, black doesn't look good for you. You can change the color. I change it to white and now it'll appear white inside the balloon. I select both the... Oh, first of all, I have to click on the arrow for select. Then I um, select all both objects, which is the text and the balloon, and then I group them together by clicking on the arrow and go to group and then select group. Now it's all grouped together, it moves together. I can click over here and on the left hand side and click on object animation. Tell it to fade out when I click the object. When I do that and select the screen, I can click on the object and it will disappear. Bam, see Sally it just popped and disappeared. Um, I can also do the same thing with the other other things I've created. There it is when the object is clicked. I click on it. Now that object has disappeared. So if I want to reset the page, I just go to the next page and come back. And now the balloons are back and they will disappear. And that's how you reset the objects on the page. Make sure you save once you have put all your names in so you have your class list for the whole year.